Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows multiple findings. Renal cyst. You can see the right kidney and it has a cyst in the upper pole of the kidney. Multiple findings are renal cyst, vesicle stones, benign prostatic hypertrophy and calcification in the prostate. You can see the measurement of the renal cyst measures about 3.4 cm into 3.2 cm in the upper pole of the kidney. Ultrasonography is generally accepted imaging technique for diagnosing and monitoring cystic renal lesions. Kidney or renal cyst are small fluid filled sacs in the kidney that are usually harmless and rarely cause symptoms. Kidney cysts are quite common and many people will have them without knowing it. Now you can see the urinary bladder and it has two stones in the urinary bladder although the urinary bladder is not properly filled with urine but the patient couldn't hold the urine. So ultrasound was done as the circumstances permitted and you can see the two large stones each measuring about 17.4 millimeter and 14.0 millimeter now you are going to see the prostate and you will see the prostate is enlarged the prostate gland surrounds the urethra and the tube through which urine passes out of the body an enlarged prostate means that gland has grown bigger in size prostate enlargement happens to almost all men as they get older an enlarged prostate is often called benign prostatic hypertrophy bph conditions that can lead to symptoms similar to those caused by enlarged prostate include urinary tract infection inflammation of the prostate prostatitis narrowing of the urethra urethral stricture Again, you are going to see the vesicle stones. These vesicle stones are formed due to urinary bladder infection. Bladder calculi occur either from the migrator renal calculi or urinary stasis. Bladder calculi can be divided into primary and secondary stones. Primary stones are formed in sterile urine, usually renal calculi which has migrated down into the bladder. The secondary stones form in the bladder due to concretions or foreign material that for example for urinary catheters. Now you can see the prostate is enlarged grossly enlarged the prostate glands surrounds the urethra the tube which through which urine passes out of the body Now the normal prostate gland ha has measure uh, has measurement of three into three into five centimeter approximately, or a volume of twenty five mL to thirty mL. Benign prostatic hypertrophy is enlargement of the prostate, a common condition among the men over forty five years of age. Now you can see the calcification. The other video showing this calcification in the enlarged prostate. This prostate is mildly enlarged, but a calcified area is seen. Now, these uh, prostate calcifications are most often an incidental and asymptomatic findings, but they have been associated with symptoms such as dysuria, hematuria, obstruction, or pelvic 
or perineal pain occasionally calcifications can be passed via the urethra very astonishing prostatic calcification is usually associated with prostatic inflammation and there are uh, there they, they are a cause there are a cause and effect relationship between them with the inflammation of the prostate the prostate acne is gets congested while the prostate gland ducts becomes narrow that causes stasis and retention of salt from the urine although interface calci calcification is common and not associated with any particular pathology peripheral zone calcification appears to be strongly associated with prostatic cancer you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button thanks